Hi guys, it is me, Got Mick. Mm. <laughs> Off to a great start. Hi guys, it is me, Got Mick, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you guys don't know, every week on my channel, I redo the makeup that I did on the main stage of RuPaul's Drag Race. This past week's runway theme was beads, and I chose a... I chose the anal option and I did a full, <laughs> I did the full anal bead artistry of it all because well, might as well stick to what you know, Gorge. <laughs> I rebuke this in the name of the Lord. It's true. And so I was like, okay, well clearly, hello. And so yeah, I did a little anal bead inspired look. So far, how the runways have played out, most of my looks have been very simple, base, black and white, very my signature eye style. So I'm so excited for this video because it is way more fun. It is full red with more shapes and artistry, which is gonna be so much more fun for you makeup angels of life at home. So I'm excited, let's get into it. <laughs> Oh, look at that new glue stick. That's the best. Oh. <laughs> Imagine. Okay, my brows are glued down, so now I'm going to start with my base. Okay, so this episode was such a fun episode for me because it was like, I was just so relieved to have like a personality challenge to start happening because I was like, okay, this dance moment, like we get it. I want to start talking. So I fully, when RuPaul said it was the reading challenge, like it was a breath of fresh air. I was ready to go and I read those bitches down. And I learned through this process that I think that's my favorite thing in the world to do, is to read people. I was just like thinking the whole time and candies came very easy to me. And I, oh. I went down the line, girl. I did every single bitch. I was like, <laughs> game over. Gay, trans, pug. <laughs> Hello darkness, my old friend. Okay, also, standing next to Rue and having her just die laughing at every single thing you said, like, I was dying laughing. I was like, I wish I could, like, be cute like Jujubee and, like, give this vibe, but I was just dying. Like, I couldn't stop laughing because RuPaul is in, like, a 10-inch heel just next to me dying laughing, and it was, it was just too much. I was, that was one of the funnest moments of my life. Period. I just love reading! I'm a... I'm so literate. <laughs> <laughs> After I won the reading challenge, we got assigned teams and they were just whoever we were standing next to at the time, which I was standing next to Olivia and Utica, which I was really excited for because Utica said she was really good at improv and <laughs> Olivia, I just love her. So I was like really excited to kind of like get out of my normal groups and have some fun with some other angels of life. And then when we sat down, those two were fighting over that mime role and I was just like, girl, I'll just take the business character. <laughs> Whatever that is, the psychiatrist. But yeah, it was just like, my character was a psychiatrist trying to sell the fucking book, so. That was fun. I was having a lot of fun trying to interpret whatever Olivia was doing. Like, it was just so stupid. Like, I felt like I forgot the whole show was going and she was just going and I was like, uh, turning butter, running, like just doing what, saying whatever she was doing. And it was so fun, I could die. Okay, so I have done this style of makeup many a times. And basically what I have to do is like draw this like circle situation onto my cheeks. And I always go back and forth if you need to contour with it or you don't. Today, I'm going to choose not to because. <laughs> Never sings mine. Just kidding. Yeah. <laughs> so, the bang bang boom. <laughs> so after I powdered, what a gorgeous time to show you my new merch. Wow. I was just gonna say that. <laughs> okay, so this eye is kind of the base of what we did last week, but it's time to level up because that was last week and this week is this week, you know? <laughs> All right, so we're going to start at your nose contour and draw a line along the bottom of the glue line or wherever you want your crease to be. This runway was like the most painful runway of my life though, secretly, because like I zip tied all of those anal beads to that outfit. Mm -hmm. And yes, I'll show you when I change it. I literally just poked holes, zip tied it, and then I never cut the zip ties thing. So when I was walking, they were just stabbing into me. It was so painful. Okay, so now we have the base of it and I glittered it on the show because I was just feeling it, which is take this and just shove it right on. Look at 
look at that. Okay, so now I am going to take some white paint and go underneath my eye, like I always do to give me that shape I need to feel it. I kind of just put it on messy because I don't really know exactly where the line is gonna be. Now we are going to take that red paint that we used on the top and draw the, you know, the line. Okay, so while that paint is still kind of wet, I'm gonna take Hi, a sisters. red eyeshadow and kind of blend it out so we can still pick up some of that paint to blend down before it dries, so hurry, hurry, hurry. <laughs> um, so basically this week I learned that I just love improv. <laughs> I really do, but also, I don't know if this is stupid, but like isn't improv like just talking? Like when you talk to someone, isn't that improv? Like I don't know what you're about to say to me. That just makes no fucking sense. I mean, it's just bullshit. <laughs> the whole improv community hates me now. <laughs> okay. Ooh. So now we have like an eye shape. What we're gonna do now is take the paint and we are basically trying to circle this. Like it's almost like we're doing blush, but like a clowny blush and we're gonna outline it instead of just blending. So like this, you know. <laughs> what the fuck? Uh, hi. It's very like, it's very jigsaw, like circle moment. We're gonna outline it and just circle that on. Ooh, 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 ooh. Now before that dries, blend, hurry, go. So we're blending really fast before that paint dries so we can have no harsh lines here, okay, girl. Mmm. <laughs> Now to add some depth, we're gonna go in with some black and just really blend that out too. And just blend this together like a little, connect it down like that. Okay, we're looking really stunning, really gorgeous. So I'm gonna take some liner. And I'm just going to make this eyeliner actually cute because it was a little spook LaRouque before. Oh yeah, another for the Got Mick Dictionary. Gagachandra. I think I wanna like marry Bimini. <laughs> I want to be Mr. Boolash. <laughs> Mr. Boolash. <laughs> I'm just going to take the red and bring it down my nose a little bit just to kind of tie everything together. I don't really know if that's even tying it together. It just seems like it would be good for me to do right now. My runway looks so far have been very about the outfits and not my makeup, so being able to finally do a little bit of artistry again feels good and I wanna keep this going, mama. So I remember getting to this stage in my makeup and being like, do I add an eyebrow? Because it looks gorgeous and I feel like I don't need to, but I ended up doing that. I don't know why, I kind of regret it, but let's add one. <laughs> I am so random, I can't believe I just did that. Sorry. I just love like, this is gorgeous, keep going. Like I don't contain the ability to stop. <laughs> nice and even, Gorge. That's how you do it here in this house. So. Obviously I drew this one a little too low, but I just raised it up and now we're gonna cover the low part with white and pretend it never happened. Uh, now we are going to highlight our face, which highlighting is always fun, but for this it's double fun because you get a highlight in the center of your cheek and it really just blends it all together. That's like a lot. I'll put some on here too. Maybe even here. Okay, so now my eye moment is basically done. All I have to do is add a red lip. What? Add a red lip. Add a red lip. <laughs> add a red lip. <laughs> okay, so now my lip is pretty much done. I'm gonna add some glitter. I'm not sure if I did that on the show, but I feel like why only glitter one spot on my face? That makes no sense, so here we go. Ow. Oh, okay. So we're done. This is definitely a little more in depth. We are starting to grow on this channel. Look at us, we're being full artists now. We went from smoky eye to this bitch, look at us. Also, let me tell you, anal beads don't come in red. Yeah, so I couldn't find some, so I had to hand paint all those red. 
Yes, I sat in a parking lot and hand painted all the anal oh, beads. Wait, there are actual anal beads on your dress? Yes. I. Why did not that like hit me? What did you think they were? I didn't realize. I don't know. Why would you pick a color that was more accessible for anal beads? Beats me. <laughs> I have no idea why. We have a short amount of time to get ready in the middle of a pandemic. I think my brain was mush. I feel like I would have done a lot of things different, but anyway, what happened happened. And I had to hand paint all these, so it was a chore and a half. So I'm into this. I'm really obsessed with this makeup and all I have to do is add a lash, go put on the look. I'll see you in a second. Okay, you guys, this is the final anal bead inspired look for my beads themed runway. But yeah, this is the final thing. I am literally like a sex shop clown right now. That's how I feel. Like I'm out on the corner saying like, come in my sex store, like flipping a sign around. Um, but I'm obsessed with it. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this process. It's such a fun artistry moment and I'm so happy to finally be able to do some fun little makeup moments on the show, so. I am so close to 100K, which I cannot believe because I feel like I just started this little YouTube journey. So thank you guys so much for following me, subscribing, whatever you call it here. <laughs> and please give me a thumbs up, a like, all the above so we can keep this going and keep killing it. I'm so excited. Like I say every single week here, I have not been eliminated yet. So I will be back next week with my runway. Next week is so fierce. As you saw in the preview, we are doing the Rusical. So make sure you tune in and then head over to my channel later in the week to see me recreate the runway look. I'm so excited. It's a good one. So thank you guys so much for watching. It means the world to me and I'll see you next week. By Gorge. I'm so look at this. Look at me right now. <laughs> you, look, you look crazy. <laughs> Ooh, super glitter. <laughs> What's the acrylic glue for? My hair. <laughs> no. No, it's for my nails. Oh, that's safe. Yeah. Yeah.